welcome everybody to the prize giving for the 9th of January, we, which was a four ball, better ball medal. And we're going to do prize giving for the morning fields and the afternoon fields. And at the very end, we'll give the jackpot winner the, the whole day. Right, so in the um, morning field, uh, the morning fields first, there were 63 players in the field and 11 visitors, so a lot of visitors, so you know the story. Please clap for all the visitors. Yay! Then in fifth place, on a count out, was uh, John Lee and Graham Biffin on 61. In fourth place, on a count out, we won the count out on 61, was Sean Neverling and Brad Jones. In third place, on 60, was Alan Cretton and G. Thomas. In second place, on a very good 59, was Daryl Brasher and Peter Grant. And first place, on an outstanding score of 58, Trevor Budd and Trevor Dunstan. So well done. <laughs> no comment. Um, no. Will there be a prize giving that doesn't mention Trevor Budder, we wonder? And Trevor Dunstan. <laughs> well. Let's do the uh, the afternoon. We'll do the afternoon first. Right. Um, in fourth place, this shows how good the morning field was when you look at the afternoon field. In fourth place was Trent Barton and Kurt Northmore on 63 on the count out. In second place was Lee Walker and Tom Bray. Nice to see Tom in the prize giving. 62 on the count out. In second, uh, father and son Marty Shum and Clint Shum, 62 on a count out. And the winners, Andrew Nash and Brian Salthouse on 61. So well done for all of them. And uh, the jackpot winner for the whole day on 12 was Peter Grant. Well done, Peter Grant. That's a very good score uh, for jackpot. And the nearest the pin was Cyril in Kabindi. Well done, Cyril. No arguments there. Right, on to the jackpot draws. We've got a lot of names to do that on. Right there. Turn the wheel. Ah, it's number 12 again. <laughs> yeah. We'd be that accused was, of rigging it. Oh, no, not Trevor Budd again. No, actually it was... Uh, not Trevor Butter won last time, so let's see what. It was the time before. He's won, if he's won the jackpot, which is 2,055. No, sadly not. But we clearly write the names down, and uh, thank you for all attending the virtual prize giving.